Welcome! In front of me is a Galaxy Note 10 Lite and today I will show you how to enable and set up the portable hotspot. And to get started, let's pull down the notification panel and look for the hotspot toggle, which for me looks to be... right here, mobile hotspot. So once you find it, uh, what I advise you to do is actually hold the toggle. This will quickly take you to the settings where you can change things like, for instance, our password. By default, as you can see, it's just going to be some randomly generated uh, password. So what you can do is simply tap on it. Oh, uh, first we just get to click on configure. And now we can select password, assuming it is not in my dead zone, which it is. Oh, there we go, managed to click it. So from here, once you select it, you can remove it and set your own password. It does need to have eight characters in length, like so, at which point you will be able to save it. Now below that, we do have the AP band. We have the option between 2.4 or 5 gigahertz. Now this is something completely uh, different than the 5G connectivity of like phones right nowadays. Uh, this is strictly just for Wi-Fi and has been around for a little bit longer. So there's a high chance that whatever device you will be trying to connect to this hotspot with will support 5G. If it does not, then that Wi-Fi will just not be visible at all. And if that is the case, then just go back here and drop it back to 2.4. Uh, now, additionally, you could also change the name of the network right here. By default, it's always the name of the device. So if you want to change it, go right ahead. If you don't care, leave it as it is. And we also have some advanced options right here, so you can choose which things you want to change. Now, once you have set it all up, simply click on the save and leave this area and go back to the toggle itself where you'll all need to tap on the toggle to turn it on. Now, unfortunately, I didn't insert a SIM card, so it won't turn on. But once you have a SIM card, all you need to do is just simply click on the toggle like I just did. And instead of having this pop up, it will just turn on. And that's about it. And once you're done with it, I do recommend you to turn it off. Try to remember it. There didn't seem to be an option, at least I didn't look for it, um, for it to turn off automatically. When you turn on hotspot, it does consume more battery. So if you turn it off once you're done with it, uh, your battery life will well, live a little bit longer. So anyway, now this is how you'd set it up and use it. And if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.